Hello and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda with your three lords into the mad. Now I wonder, uh, does every n upgrade I make for the nomad just immediately get applied? Or is there some something more to it? And that's just showing to me that this the tech lab. The serphonics, that is the vortex, and there is something in there. That looks to be the way to the habitation deck. That's cool. But first, the vortex. It's time to party. Like it's... Party time. That's, those are my dance moves. You know they're lovely. Hello. Hey, I was wondering if you could help me out. It's for the good of the bar. Sure. Lay it on me. So folks try and help and all, but we have a limited pool of ingredients. Keep an eye out for anything interesting we could use for new drinks, and we'll let you test them for free. Right. I get a feeling the testing will be interesting. Don't worry. Dutch may complain a lot, but he's loving it. And he's the best chemist I know. You're in good hands. Okay. Hi, Dutch. Oh, another one. Damn it. This is supposed to be the chemistry lab. My chemistry lab. You all keep crawling out of the woodwork like space cockroaches. You say that, Dutch, but here you are, pouring people drinks. Uh, hi. I'm standing right here. They're guinea pigs, damn it. Chemists should have guinea pigs. Not have their labs taken over by people giving them things and, and being nice. Aren't bartenders usually friendly? You're kind of hostile. I'm not supposed to be a bartender. I'm supposed to be a chemist. Don't let Dutch put you off. He's a sweetie, really. I'm not. And the drinks are good. Damn right they are. Uh, I mean, <sighs> yeah, I'm a dirty squirrel. That's a dirty squirrel. Got anything else to say? You're back. People happen when you work at a bar. <laughs> Got you there, Dutch. I'll have to get used to you too, I guess. <laughs> Fine. You can be a regular. What's your name? Scott. I'm Dutch. That's Anan over there. Be careful. The snark is strong with that one. Snark is good. I can work with snark. Ugh. You're one of those. Looks like you're outnumbered, Dutch. You'd think people would reconsider picking on the guy making the drinks, but no. Speaking of, want to try this one? I'm going to call it the Tall Moose. I'm just getting drunk. I'm not sure if uh, Scott liked that one. Is are all of these like special hello conversations? Again. Oh, I mean, hello, welcome to my lab. Bar, whatever. Oh, Dutch, look at you, getting all used to things. Things are fine. It's people I don't like. They talk back. Maybe they can't resist your charm. I hadn't thought of that. Wait, you're messing with me, aren't you? I would never. Right, here, have a drink. Rotten scoundrel. Are you calling me rotten scoundrel? Hey, or? <laughs> The drink, <laughs> not you. Seems that was intentional. Drink of the hour is a lucky leprechaun. Wanna give it a shot? How lucky are we talking here? I forget where the ingredients are from. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Excellent. No, oh, that's the worst that could happen. I hope I have my kidneys by the end of this. Oh, nope. I wake up on the stage. Now I'm really curious what happened. Tell me. You again. Me again. 
Welcome to the Vortex. Oh, hi, Liam. I didn't notice you here before. Things are shaping up, Pathfinder. Resources flowing in, sleep is ready to head out. It's starting to feel like the initiative. Not quite up to the sales pitch, but we're getting there. Feels good, right? I feel it, Liam. Finally getting our start. There we go. Getting our shit together. Showing the new galaxy that we have it sorted. If I keep saying it, it's true, right? <laughs> Close enough. Ryder. Liam. Anyone else here that I know? Nope. And I can't dance. I'm not allowed to dance. I can't even do like shepherd moves. So to be fair, shepherd moves are shepherd moves. Hmm. There's a quest marker over there that I might want to look at. I'm supposed to find Spender. Pathfinder, watch your tone. You saw what happened to the Krogan. But we need this equipment. Well, you're not getting it. Stop making frivolous requests. It's What's up? Your incompetence isn't my problem. Just do your job. Oh, that's Spender. What do you want? Sounds like you're having a rough day. You saw that, huh? Oh, I'm sorry I snapped at you. The way Spender treats me? Everyone, I'm just... so angry. I don't understand how he's in any position of authority. He was pretty abusive towards you. Is that... normal? Yes, he's horrible. Working with him is a total nightmare. Just last week, he tried to redirect some of the supplies we need to keep the stasis pods going. Why? I have no idea. But if Kesh hadn't stepped in and threatened to airlock him, it would have been a disaster. He's always like that. Making bad decisions, driving the Krogan away, treating people like scum when no one's watching. Maybe there's something I can do? A man like that's bound to have some dirt. I wish Tan and Addison could see it. Things have gotten so bad that Kesh had to literally kick him out of engineering. How literal are we talking here? Boot to ass. Oh, it was glorious. We need him gone, but as incompetent as Spender is at his job, he's insanely good at keeping it. Kesh can tell you more. Thank you. I think that means we can now move on towards... Yeah, further into the Nexus. Go to the habitation deck or something. So the habitation deck is probably... What do we have? We have operations, we have habitation and we have fire bay. Oh, the habitation deck is... on the Hyperion. So operations is actually where we should be going right now. A violent illness related to cherry-like fruit brought back from Habitat 7 as authorities battled. Multiple passengers are still in quarantine. This is Asian S. Alright. Operations. Oh, these guidelines from your recruits are killing me. When I was a merc, you figured out rookies with your gut. Not some questionnaire. Exactly. Mercenaries run things their way. Weekly injury report. Book. Casualty rate but matches militia. projections. We need the police in the Nexus. We gotta do both. Okay. Did you finish the mission? You won! Congratulations! I have no idea what mission funds do, but you have leveled up. You are a level 3 team now. No? I have 45 mission funds and I'm not gonna give you anything yet because I have no idea if these are one time use or anything like that. So we're just gonna look into getting you more things. Oh, I can also recruit another team. Let's do that for now. We have Bravo and we have Romeo, so we have RB. 
Right. Eliminate supply ships. We should treat with the hero alien presence remnant. Weapon reports. The room for error, outlaw enemies everywhere. And protect engineer personnel. Okay, we're, we're gonna send uh, Romeo to defend. And we're gonna send Bravo here to do that. And I'm not gonna go to multiplayer. Because that sounds like something I should be doing out of my own time. No news on the Turian Arc yet. Or is this militia business? Bye, Kendros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. I was just curious, really. You seem to be dancing. That's a good thing to do. Hey, Ryder, I'd like a moment. Yes, Lieutenant Syax, right? That's me. I'm putting together Apex strike teams to protect the people and assets you're setting up out there. We don't have a good sense of what we're up against and could benefit from your experience. I'll have Sam upload our insights on the Cat, Remnant, and Outlaw forces we've encountered. Thanks. You'll see. Apex will make a difference. Thank you. None of you are... Supply request is in. Dispatching to your location. Has confirmed full deployment on the EO. We expect the colony to be fully self-supporting soon and able... I see it. It's you! You're the human Pathfinder! I'm Sid, Betra's sister. Betra's told me all about you. Well, not all about you, but the important bits. I should probably get back to work. It was real nice meeting you, though. What work do you do here? Oh, I just monitor comms from colonists. Progress updates, hazards encountered. Note it down, pass on a report to Sean at the end of the day. Important job. I know. It's nice to hand in a report and have someone say I helped. I'll let you get back to work. Apex personnel, please yeah, even you met someone. A precious sister-in-law, if everything goes to plan. An animal did what? this? Affirmative. I am able to track it. I can't believe he's not returning my... Pathfinder? Wow. I'm Davis Carr, Elias News Service. Maybe you've heard my voice over the vids. I'm trying to file a story right now, but hey. HNS, huh? Where are the rest of you? I had an editor, but it's crazy out here. Now, beyond a freelancer or two, I'm it. All that stands between freedom and tyranny, or something. I haven't had much sleep. Who pays for you to do this? Technically, HNS is an arm of the initiative, but we serve the public, not them. Sometimes the higher ups try and tell us what to broadcast, Tan especially, but we decide what to run and how to run it. It causes friction, but at least I can live with myself. Were you a journalist back in the Milky Way? I was. Sort of. Only had a couple internships under my belt. Good places, though. The New Star Chronicle even sent me to Mars for a week. The plan was just to work as a reporter out here. Then the uprising happened. We got a little too close. My editor was killed. Tan blamed our broadcasts for stirring unrest. It was bullshit. Now all I want to do is keep going. I met another journalist, Carrie Tavessa. Yeah, we're running Carrie's series, Path of a Hero. Good stuff. I'm mostly on my own, so pretty much anyone who brings me news is welcome. Content is king, and her content is really touching a nerve. It must be difficult to set up a broadcast from scratch. Well, it's easy. Beyond the lack of staff, resistant authorities, and constant technical glitches. Still, I'm getting there. May have an honest-to-goodness source in Nexus security, if she ever calls me back. Who's your source? No journalist worth their salt will ever give that up. That's well done. Talk to you later, Davis. Hey, Ryder, before you go, I hate to ask, but it seems like your job takes you all over, the places we can't broadcast yet. 
If I send receivers to your ship, would you mind placing them on some planets? It'll help get news out to even the most far-flung colonists. What do you need from me, exactly? I'm digging up good stories here, but not a lot of people beyond the Nexus can hear them. Our long-distance transmitter sends package data between ships and even planet side, provided there's a receiver on the other end. I need someone to place receivers and boost our signal. We only have a few, so they need to go on planets with people. Sure. Okay, Davis. I'll help you get set up. Great. Just place a receiver near an outpost, and they'll get our reports. A reminder to all personnel over time... Nifty, now we already have reason to go back to Yes. Yep, we already checked out of the security box, right? Yeah. I hear you went down to Eos. Did you find anything to help my case? An enemy blast to the back killed the chief. Your shot missed. What? You, you're kidding me. Thank the spirits. This is great. Hold on there. The chief's Omni tool recorded you over the body. Sam, playback. Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. Shit. Not only did you think you killed him, you meant to. But you just said I didn't, so it doesn't matter, right? The conviction will have to be overturned. The sentence thrown out. I'm going to Tam, and I might have a different opinion. You did try to cover it all up. Look, I'm sorry I lied, but if my shot missed, I'm innocent, plain and simple. We'll see about that. I don't actually want to contain him, to be honest. I am sad that uh, this is the way it went, but... I think it's a good play. Well, minus the murdering part. Oh. You know, that's, that's uh, that happens to the best of us, really. Just occasionally murder someone. It's not an always an intentional thing. We hurt our friends. It's what... People do. Just usually not in actual mode of capacity. Okay, Kesh, I have a lot to talk to you about. How many times have I told you this story? 343. Wait, what? You be keeping count? <laughs> Rushan, that's not funny. What are you? Pathfinder. I believe you found the culprit responsible for the power shortages. Alert Professor Herrick to come secure it. Cool. Colonial Affairs, please advise Director Tan of your status. For but this thirty oh. I think I already read this one, right? Hi Drac. Ryder, can you believe this place? One space station slightly dented? You should have seen it a year ago. It was more than just dented. Anyway, thanks for bringing me on. Tan can't kick me off the station now, and it's been nice seeing my granddaughter again. The two of you seem close. It's been Kesha and me against the galaxy the moment I got her. Can you do... Well, maybe not as much now, but it sure was early on. Could you stop building trusting? It seems weird. Track? You sure look thoughtful. Just thinking about the first time Cash got her hands on a toolkit. Master engineer from the day she was born? Quads, no. She worked hard at it. Let's see, the first time, yeah, it was our power generator. She took it apart. <laughs> With the blood side. Wouldn't that cause shorts or something? She liked the fireworks. You can imagine what it was like when she figured out that cracking open bigger things made even bigger sparks. <laughs> Drak, stop running around. I'm trying to talk to you. Drak? Pathfinder, thanks for helping Roz and Zara find Adam. He's not getting out of lockup for a while. Hey, Ryder. Yeah. 
Hey, Drek. All right. Divert some power from the lower decks. What about the report Spender wants? Ignore them. He can't complain to number eight about what he doesn't know. If he bothers you, let me know. I'll drop by for a chat. Dell told me you saw her arguing with Spender. Pijak's doing his best to throttle my department. How's he getting away with that? Spender doesn't know the first thing about engineering, but he knows how to play people. More importantly, he still talks to the Exiles. I'm sure of it. I just can't prove it without your help. This needs to be investigated. I'm glad someone thinks so. Talk to Kandros. He likely has security footage of some kind of evidence. But you'll have to convince him to authorize release. Nothing more for now. Later. That was pretty straightforward. Okay, let's let's focus on this task. Maybe we can so resolve this this time. No news on the Turian Arc yet. Or is this militia business? I was told I should talk to you about the mutiny. I wasn't on the Nexus when it happened. I started reading up on it, but you know how things get around here. Do you know where Spender was during that time? Why Spender? Wait, you think he might have had something to do with the mutiny? Maybe. Just trying to sort things out. You know, the logs I did look through showed a few discrepancies. I meant to dig deeper. If you're investigating, how about I give you access to the security vid archives? Thank you. Anything else? No, thanks. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. I like how... Apex team leaders reporting back. How everyone is always ready. Okay, they're apparently already done. Is that right? I know that's... Still three hours and that's still one hour. That's a fair bit of time. That is it like in-game hours? Can I close the game and whenever I start recording again, I can just pick them up? It's probably just in-game time, isn't it? Huh, this file won't play. Sam, can you boost the quality? Processing. Playback initiated. Wait, is he handing something over to one of the mutineers? Take this back. It'll help you the armory. Don't I am sorry, Pathfinder. This backup file is corrupted. The audio tracks are heavily degraded. Someone may have deleted the original, and this version was restored during a system-wide reset. Sounds like a cover-up to me. I concur. While I cannot restore any more audio, the location appears to be Kadara. How do you figure? In common parlance. Lip reading. I do not recognize the location from any current data. It appears mountainous and populated. We will need to find the planet before I can confirm. I will contact you via my node. Let's go confront him. Where is Spender right now? Oh, here? Good. That's convenient. Apex personnel, please check your duty roster for important updates. Oh, that's Spender. Oh, does that mean we have to dig to the dick ourselves? Just a minute. The mutiny went as well as you'd expect. So much violence. Then, after nearly destroying the station, the Krogan asked for more power? Good riddance. Ryder, is it? William Spender. Apologies if we met before. I meet a lot of people running Colonial Affairs. Running Colonial Affairs? I thought you were the Assistant Director. That's right. Assistant to Addison. So we know who does all the real work. From what I've heard, your hands are pretty dirty. I saw the footage. You were handing something off? What footage? From Gavorkum? Routine business meeting. Whoever you're talking to clearly has an axe to grind. And frankly, a Pathfinder shouldn't be wasting time on a witch hunt. You'd be wise to let this be. Dun 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 dun. Kerry! Hi. The documentary's going great. Your comments really got people talking. By the way, Tan called us in for a talk about staying on message. Is everything okay? Oh, fine. And much less interesting than what you've been up to. The scientists are excited about your new outpost, though there are questions about how Prodromos can survive where Sites 1 and 2 failed. 
My team and I surveyed Eos thoroughly, and even stopped the storms. The rest is up to the outpost, but the old threats are gone. Hopefully they can handle any new ones. Facing those risks must be stressful. How do you relax between missions? My crew and I take downtime together. We're a team. This is history too, these little moments between. Shots of this remnant tech, some narration, that completes an episode. Thanks for stopping. Apparently you can uh, romance uh, in addition to whoever your main romance is, so that's cool. Okay, Ride the Family Secrets, Missing Ox, yeah those are gonna be waiting. Alright, I think I will call it here for now and we'll look into the further activities in this part of the ship next time we have Two reasons to speak with Tan, and I think that is gonna take us a while because Tan can talk a lot, especially when we have two missions to talk about. So thanks for watching, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.